why women should do OnlyFans. Women should do OnlyFans because they can earn a lot of money. I think their family will be absolutely fine if they sit down and have that discussion beforehand. What if they're not okay with it? Then cut them loose. (laughs) (laughs) Nah, that's hectic shit. Overpower, overpower, overpower until you have them, Matt. And that's how you did it, prick. Welcome to episode number seven of the Muddy Michael Fully Actual Podcast. We're coming to you from fucking... Your dress is full. Whoa. Yeah, maybe not yet. Maybe <laughs> beat that. Maybe we'll have that. to like put like put, put like, like the, a the fucking black black house over my mouth, over bro. The mouth. Connor, put like yeah. a picture of a fucking our house. No, put put the picture of the number that I was saying <laughs> over my mouth. <laughs> Marty just said our address. No, no, we need, to, we need to hide that. Otherwise, I'll give out your addresses. <laughs> you don't even know where I live, bro. Yes, that, I do. That's a facade. Oh. That's a facade. Oh. Oh. Do you remember oh. that guy? Yeah, Nothing but a facade. facade. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, okay. That guy was fucking rock and roll, baby. We got a jam-packed episode. We got a lying segment. We got Matt's dream diary. The Great Debate Returns, Bamboozled is back, and the voicemail segment, we've shortened down a little bit, and guess what, the How Famous Are We segment, we're going to do it fortnightly, so you'll see that again next week, and of course a fucking prank call that's going to blow your fucking mother's brains out the back of her skull when she shits herself with a fucking shotgun right in her mouth. That's how crazy it's going to be, bro. So speaking of ourselves it was matt brown's birthday over the weekend and fuck me 44th birthday he had a I'm great 37 day. and man did we have a fucking party here on sunday whoa, Dude, whoa. We, we did some dangerous shit in between the watching of the usc <laughs> yeah, I, no, it was a that was a cool chill day <laughs> yeah i did i must admit i like days like that it was me michael matt james we all just came here watched the ufc yeah. got a bit high and then we went and played outside a little bit and the fights were really good yeah, and James yeah. nearly killed himself by shooting a Oh, my God. Yet. It was literally it's probably like a meter away oh, from No, not it. even that. Like, I was standing right there half a foot from James. It was yeah. terrifying. Oh, he couldn't see. Yeah. That's why I was like this. I was like, oh, my God, we nearly lost but a But the friend. tree did stop it from going, reaching, like, maximum yeah. and velocity. stupidly, that was an actual arrow. Like, we didn't take the tip off. So yeah. it would have just gone oh, really? straight through him. Yeah. I'm sorry yeah. about that. That's okay. How um, was your birthday? What did you get? And uh, what happened to you? Um... No, I had a good birthday. Uh, I'll start with work. <laughs> oh, <God>. oh! <laughs> uh, no, everyone at Wholesome were fucking legends, especially uh, my mate Molly. She like went above and beyond for my birthday. I and think they... she wants to. No, Holy she's... shit, she's you've married. been. <laughs> Nothing. Can, can you cut that out? <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, because that's. Sorry. I don't want on that. I don't want that on there. Molly's um, chambers. All right, all right. But, um, yeah. But uh, no, she went above and beyond, and she. Da- um... <laughs> <laughs> you can't have that on there. Yeah, we're not, we're no, not no, we really, it, we re- we're just leave the laughter in though. That's no, yeah, yeah, leave the laughter, but we really can't have that on there because she watches. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're only joking. Be Molly's, quite awkward. Molly, Molly, um, Molly Meldrum, and uh, everyone at Wholesome went above and beyond. They decorated my desk, and they got me a little card. They have the same sense of humor. Does as everyone, everyone else. So everyone at your work, just to be clear, knows that you do this. You dress up and you do this on a Monday. Yeah, it's getting out there. They printed off photos. Yeah, I saw from, that. Yeah. So everyone in the office now knows that you. Like, surely there must be some people walking around thinking, oh, like Matt's like transitioning and he just dresses up on the weekend. <laughs> I don't know up for fun. But every now and then, like somebody will make a comment to me, and like it's like some of like you a, fucking yeah. People <laughs> say that. <laughs> <laughs> like some of the blokey blokes are like. Oh yeah, you look like you had a had a fun weekend <laughs> when I when I post something, and <laughs> and I just it'll be a picture of me on the set, and yeah, you can just tell that they're like not sure what's yeah. what's going on there. Matt Brown yeah, is okay. on nine thousand nine hundred followers, by That's the way, guys. So, so if you want, really, he's, and he's been stressing me, pulling me aside, and saying, oh, "Marty, I'm so God. close. Please, can you please, no, please just help I me, help me, help me, please not. help me." So guys, no, let's get I Matt to ten k and follow him at. Matt Brown, one, 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 four number ones, all right? Get him to that 10K mark so we can start fucking doing some promo for Wholesome and shit, man. Because, man, they've been relying on that. Would you say at Wholesome they are quite wholesome? No. Okay. Oh, okay. And also, would you take one of the ones out from your Instagram tag if you could? So it's three is a better number than four. No, I want four ones okay. over three. There you go. It's, it's either no ones or four. 
Four's too famous now. Have you seen people who make jokes and then they add four ones in the end? I can tell that's a, a stab at my Instagram because <laughs> you guys said it was a shit name. All 9,900 of them. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, Maddie's birthday on the weekend. Other than that, we just played a bit of golf, didn't we? And oh, man, played some bad, bad golf. <sighs> yeah, I played really, really badly too. It was off, <sighs> off-puttingly bad. It was oh, like right. not... And at a level where I just wasn't enjoying it. So I just had to have a couple of holes off every now and then. But the weed cookies were nice. You just kind of chill and it was a really nice course, Pine Rivers. So you just kind of lie there and watch the highness, you know? Yeah, yeah shout out to Troy from Pine Rivers, legend. Yeah, yeah, bloody oath. Troy had a couple of yarns, didn't he? Yeah, one, yeah. one or two or three or four or five or six or seven or eight or nine or ten yarns. We've got with us. two hours free at the golf <laughs> simulator. Yeah, he's given us two hours free at the golf simulator. <laughs> hour of chat, hour of golf. Yeah, exactly right, mate. So, uh, yeah, fucking good weekend all around. And here we are. We filmed some f- fucking bangers last week. Three website videos. Trolley curling, bloody um, uh, oh my god, the ha- oh. ha- ha- like trying to solve world thirst. That was is a <laughs> fucked one. Yeah, that was a different one. That was so fucked. What, what was the other third, third one? one? We fucking something to do with genders. No, 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 that wasn't last week. Lockie was here to film, and it was um, what did we film? Oh, Lockie? what about the oh, hackers checkers? Oh yeah, we filmed fucking right. hackers checkers. So website members, if you know torture chess, this is kind of like that, except there's bongs involved. And shit gets fucking, it ended up being pretty funny, I think. It's hard to tell when you're stoned out of your mind. Also, one amazing thing we're doing, we are doing a $50,000 giveaway on our website, okay? This is not like $50,000. This is the biggest giveaway we have, we've ever done. All the money you website members give us, we're very grateful for, and we're going to give some of it back to one person. All you have to do is be signed up to the website to be in the running. So Matt's not currently, you can't win. You can't win fifty have, grand. Have you ever had fifty I, grand in your life? That is life changing amount. Yeah, like that we're, is, we're like you could buy f- a house. We're, we're, we thought about it. House. Yeah, yeah, we we thought about this right, and we're like, let's let's make it a mu- amount an amount of money. This is a big gamble. We aren't. Yeah, like Michael. Michael is. We, we went back and forth on this. Okay, this is this was not an easy decision. Fifty thousand dollars is a, still a lot of money to us. Okay, but that's what we're doing. We're going to give it back to one of our website members. So if you want to sign up and be in the running for it, all you got to do is just be signed up. Even if you're in the 21 day free trial, when the winner is announced, you are still in the running. Okay, so all you got to do is sign up. Link is in the fucking bio. 50 grand, Matt. What would you do with $50,000? I'd, I'd, sorry. Um, what would you what do? What would you it? do? Basketball cards. Nah, I'd, that'd be towards a house. Really? Yeah. It's a deposit for a house. So basically, we are buying you a house. That's what we do here. Or at half a Michael. Bitcoin. Um, nah, that's sorry. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. sorry. Yeah, 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 I guess, yeah. We, oh, we're no, giving I'm you half sorry. a Bitcoin. Yeah. yeah. But what would you do? <laughs> if you're someone's at <laughs> home. You. Say it again. <laughs> He's stoned. A little bit. <laughs> 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 that cookie hit far too early. <laughs> um, I, I put it towards a house. What sort of house? <laughs> uh, one with a roof. Wow. That doesn't leak. <laughs> That'd be cool. Um, so can I sign up and win that technically? Yeah, you could. But nah, let's to be just honest, put out like well, I've thought about soft. this. No, imagine if imagine if because we have this uh oh, how program do you pick that picks it. Yeah. yeah. So imagine if you know the email that I'm signed up with to our website. Imagine if that one. We and couldn't. then we oh look every, if I if I <laughs> genuinely won though, himself. We, oh dude, look everyone I win the money that reminds <laughs> me of a draw we did once oh yeah and you were picking out the name saying it before it came dude, out dude we did a fucking for charity we did oh. a giveaway it was so cringe we did we had and all the names are individually written on little pieces of paper there's thousands of them in this spinning thing and as we we're putting the names in I just picked one out and read it this person is gonna win. Throw it in. We just spin the thing, spin the thing, pull it out. And then that person fucking won. So it fully looked like we'd rigged it because I fucking called it. It's like one in a 2,000 <laughs> chance. <laughs> yeah, dude. And then we looked like assholes. It looked like we'd rigged it <laughs> at a charity <laughs> event. And so we had to we had to rip that up and do the whole thing again. And really? That guy missed Didn't, it. No, 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 we did. We did give it to that guy. Yeah, yeah. I lied about that I'm last pretty bit. sure <laughs> that we're like, oh, let's just see. And we picked out another one and it was him again. He had multiple in there. Really? Yeah, I made no, nah, I made that up. Okay, thank you. So, what a boring end to that story. You guys <laughs> lying. <laughs> Speaking about lying, let's get into the sponsors. Oh yes. Now this, they're doing a one-time offer. 
you're promoting your health and you're also they're going to give away fifty thousand dollars <laughs> who is ag1 really <laughs> i haven't heard about this that's a lie <laughs> <laughs> all right everyone listen up do you is someone you know dead yeah <laughs> Well, there's probably a good chance that they won't take an AG1. Am I right? Was the dead person you know taking AG1? <laughs> there you go. Proofs in the pudding. So if you are like, if you are living and you want to stay living, go to AG1. Okay, use our discount code. Fully actual. That gives you this health powder with 75 vital nutrients and minerals mm. in it that you cannot get from a diet, baby. Hell you yeah. can't get that shit from a diet, baby. That's it. You're gonna die. If you don't have it, go to AG1, fully actual. I just can't get, get a free travel pack, baby. AG1, it's bitch. It's a subscription. It rocks up at your front door every month. I have one a day, baby. It's going to add years to your life, bitch. Years. Hey, hey, yeah. Look at all of us. Woo! Also, $50,000 giveaway from them. Maybe. that might Michael might be confusing that with the $50,000 we're giving away. So that, it's all a bit of confusion there. But it's smoke and Maris. The link in our bio, click, click the link in the description, go to AG1 and have a look for your fucking self, baby. Because so many people, are f- the word about AG1 is spreading around like a f-ing virus, bro. Like a f-ing herpes sore on your f-ing big dick. Mm. I have it two times a day now. That's too much. That's- you could die. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, no. everyone. What, you, you have cold die? sores twice a day? No, no, AG1. <laughs> <laughs> have it before boxing and then before a workout. Yeah. I don't think you're meant to have more than two doses. I read the packet. Like you can, I I, I swear it's definitely you have, can have start more. having you ten. Have, yeah, I'll start, start having, having 10. ten packets a day and I'll see what happens. 10. Anyway, there you go, guys. Go and have a bloody look at and bloody look after yourself out there because God knows the shits out there to f you up. Everything you fucking look at's here to kill you. Freedom. So fucking get, sort yourself before you get fucked. Ag one. That should be their tagline. Sort yourself before you get fucked. <laughs> 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 Seriously though, food these days, you can't buy a fucking thing without fucking shit in it. Dude, even like bread, vegetables, pesticide. Dude, look at mm. like bread now. Like I've, I've, I saw this the other day too. You know, if you buy, buy blackberries, fully put me off berries in, in general now. You buy blackberries, non-organic ones, and if you juice those blackberries, you could use that juice to spray the next crop of blackberries as pesticides. That's how much they absorb the pesticides. You bastard. Yeah, I don't... Well, I've never have, helping I, you, I've man. had so many... Ba- oh. Dude, so have I. So yeah, have I, too. but I've stopped now. I heard oh, from organic's that's okay. Yeah, organic's I know, okay. but like it's like trip. Yeah, yeah it's okay. like I did, I did it from James's mum. If you if you dilute them in baking soda and water, that it's the best way to but get rid of. Fuck them. doing that every yeah. time. It, does, it is. I a know, lot of and work. then they taste like cake, bro. Oh. It is a lot of work, but cake is good. Anyway, fucking there you go. Look after yourself. Yeah, AG One is very <laughs> very fucking good for you. Speaking of being very fucking good for you, shit. Well. I don't even I don't even know if if you haven't gone to manscaped.com yet and had a look at their products. Seriously, like from the bottom of my heart, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you for not even having a look. We've spoken about this at length, how you can start to look after yourself. Fuck you. You sit there and you listen for fucking free every week and you don't even go and have a look. The link is in the description. Oh, it's too expensive. Okay, all right, we'll have 20% off. How's that? For the actual 20, 20% off. I've sliced that off for you. <laughs> What's it if called? If one-fifth of your body was cut off, it'd be a substantial amount. So one-fifth of the price is gone mm. and that's on us. We'll take that. We'll take that cost and we'll eat it. Yeah. So get on manscaped.com. Have a look at all this shit. Okay, I'm sure there's something in there for you. As you reach your 30s, your nose hairs start to grow. Some oh. come down and start tickling my fucking moustache. Mm. They got a thing for that. You shove it in your nose, all gone. So nice. It's clear for coke too. Yeah. Now you can do the cocaine without any uh, obstruction, just a smooth gliding as the rack sticks to your nose walls and absorbs into your soft tissue, straight into the bloodstream and straight into your brain to deliver maximum dopamine surge. You can also shave your balls without fear of cutting. You can shave your balls and smash them in cocaine, smoosh cocaine all over your freshly shaven dick. You can, If you're a woman, you can shave your breasts and, and scoop up a large amount of cocaine and, and powder your tits. Ah. 
And it's all it's all good, man. Well, yeah, the cocaine does help, but if you have think about this, if you if you shave your balls, sex is way better. You got nowhere. No to- one wants like matte hair, fucking string wire. You know, it's fucked. Man, I don't, I, man, you're right, bro. I gotta start shaving my fucking hairs. They go out like fucking tree roots. Yeah, they're weird. They go like, yeah, real curly. And they're hard like tree roots. And all the sweat from sport starts to stick to it. So you get like compact dead skin cells they, at the base of your balls. And they twist together. They twist together to form Matted some hair. kind of fucking dreadlock. Yeah. A nut dreadlock. And sometimes you don't wipe your ass properly and you wipe sort of backwards to forwards and then the shit gets all in the hair yeah, that of never your happened. Yeah, so that's, that's never happened, never happened to anyone. That's never happened to anyone. anyone. What's wrong with your ass? Manscaped, is? fully actual 20 for 20% off. That's never happened to anyone. Okay. It's also for women out there with huge, huge tits. <laughs> Hairy if ones. If you're, a, if you're a huge breasted lady, yeah, all, all jump tits. on Manscaped. No, I think... Mm. Man, Bigger think, is preferred from. No, I think they do. I think they do cater to all tit sizes, but huge, massive breasts, hairy ones. Yeah, yeah. the hair are ones. preferred. So anyway, there you go. Look, that's that's manscape for you. So also for women. Let's move on. Man! Let's have a quick bong break. Actually, a fucking big hard bong break. A fucking big hard bong break, and we'll be right back with the lying segment. Matt's dream diary and the great debate. Uh, that's right, Michael, which means it's time for the lying segment, everybody. <laughs> a, a segment that we don't plan beforehand. And we're going to discuss now which friend we're going to call and who we're going to lie to. Emil? I'll do James. We'll say we're going to cancel Bamboozled for today. And he's just finished preparing. No, no, no. I, can't, I, can't, I, couldn't even, I couldn't even bear to hear his response to that. It would break my heart so much. Shut it's up. Lighter, I know. We're, we're calling Ryan. Let's Yuck. call Ryan and lie to Ryan. What could we say to Ryan? Tell him that we're not doing the podcast. Let's, oh, that, I've got it. Let's tell him, hey, dude, just let you know you can have an early mark today. No. <laughs> <laughs> we let him know that he gets to leave like two, an hour and a half before he normally goes home. But then we say, sorry, mate, we're just lying. and You've got to stay for the rest of the day and we see his reaction. Let's call him. Oh, man, I don't know. This is hard. I'm torn, man. Or, <laughs> I'm torn or in harm. what about you? We say, hey, what are you doing tonight? Um, there's a worms tournament on in the he, city. He would know that's a lie. Okay. But like I like where you go, oh, uh, we could do, uh, no, nah, that's too mean. I can't lie about worm stuff. Worm stuff's very important. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, imagine if I said, hey, we're about to Oh, we're I just up. heard what he said. <laughs> what about, Fuck you. What about, look, we haven't You lied. say trading cards are dumb. <laughs> Fuck you. Look, you don't, you've never been top 10 at something in the world. I have. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. I get that. He's Michael's good at his shit hobby. <laughs> hey, what are you saying? I'm not. <laughs> no, no, you're getting up there, eh? You got a, you got a mad Your hobby collection. doesn't take skill. It's just buy, see if you get a good thing. <laughs> buy, see if you get a good. Yours thing. doesn't take skill either, <laughs> mate. Oh, that's look at our board. <laughs> if I spent as many hours as you have on there, easy. No, no, there's no, no skill to it, mate. Yeah, your our match play. Even I, I'll give you. Fifty dollars. I'll give you fifty dollars. Right I'll let now, you. Mate. I won't train for a year, and you can play all year and catch up, and then I'd I'll win. play you. And I guarantee I'd I will beat your worms. I will beat you. I will. So you, you can't play for a year. You, he wouldn't be able to do that. Yeah, I know. That's my whole point. I want him to shake hands, okay, yeah, so we don't I have to put up with that fucking worms for a year. <laughs> okay, look. I'd pay fifty k to you. Worms play. is very important. Look, okay. look, we, we're, we're off topic. We need to think of someone right. alive. Yeah. I, I get I get scared about uh, Ryan's such a young, he's such a friendly, yeah. nice boy. Yeah, he's I guess so yeah. trusting. Sorry, Ryan. <laughs> he's going to probably be editing or looking at this like through. Because <laughs> like, like, I think back, like, remember when we were coaching, if someone said, you can go home early, dude, I would be just immediately filled with such joy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I mean. It's so fu- Oh, It's like, it's the... It's the greater risk, like oh, it's the sacrifice. In any joke, someone has to be sacrificed. Look, if, if you call it, okay, I'll do it. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ryan. Watch your feet there. You don't disconnect. Yourself. I'm sorry. He's gonna know it's a. Play. I'm. Okay, yeah. I'm. I'm thinking he's gonna know. All right. He's gonna know it's a lie. All right, guys. So what we're doing? And why wouldn't you just walk out there and tell him? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, what's the reason? We'll um, just say we're. Um. We've just. We're just planning the podcast. Um. 
oh, it turns out like, oh, you can go home early today. We, we won't be, um, but don't make it sound like he's fired or anything. Oh, Just make yeah. it sound. We, Dude, won't be, we won't we, be needing you anymore. We could lie and say, <laughs> "Oh my god, oh, no, no that's way. too much." I'm afraid we're gonna we have to let you that. go. <laughs> oh, 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 I we can't even. We would bear. never do that to you, Ryan. But we're gonna make it out that you think that you're going home early right now, and you're not. I'm sorry. Yeah, maybe we can just say, um, maybe just call him be like, um, oh yeah, like, um, Mayo, we're, we're finishing up early today. Yeah, so yeah, we're feel free we just, to pack up. Okay, man. yeah, yeah, that's good. All right, here we go. We're finishing up early. Here we go. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. How's it going? Yeah, good. Um, we're just finishing up now, dude. Um, and or well, we just got to do the prank call. But I reckon mm-hmm. if you want, man, you're sweet to have an early mark today. Oh, really? Yeah, fully, dude. Ah, uh, that's sweet. <laughs> Brian, we're fucking lying, lying to you, dude. 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 We're oh lying. my god, you're oh. here till five. <laughs> you sounded That's so hopeful. Like, like you guys only just started. <laughs> <laughs> you're here till oh, five. I couldn't, oh. I couldn't lie for too long with you, dude. Oh, I felt too laughing. Mean. I felt too mean. Oh man, oh, yeah. seeing Michael's okay. face. I guess I'll just go kill myself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, dude, we still got time here. Yeah, I'm sorry, but yeah, that, for yeah. a moment, did you think you were going home? Yeah, I did a bit. <laughs> it sort of sounds like I'm in a microphone right now. Oh, true. Oh, true. So you <laughs> sort of, oh, but there you go. <laughs> sorry, dude, and thank you. Yeah, sorry, Ryan. No, no, that's, that's okay. <laughs> See you, dude. <laughs> we'll let you go back to work. Yeah, you go back to work. <laughs> Oh, watching oh, my, my, watching Michael's face as he, as yeah. each lie I came out. Look at he him. was struggling. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, it was just it, it was hard to do. <gasps> this is fucked. You know, watching you lie to Ryan, you struggled knowing that you couldn't lie to James. Like you, like no, no, I couldn't do that. But Matt, you would fuck with me in this instant. Oh no, and no, fucking instant. No, it's just, uh, for, like, no, I, no, I, I right. there is no excuse. No, I, no, you're right. Clearly, Look, I'm, I want to talk to you about this. I'm a lesser friend. No, I want to talk to you about this. I, d- I have had that thought. Like, why? Why is it funnier to me when when certain friends get hurt? Like when Michael fucks something up. I don't know why. It's just fucking hilarious to me. When you fuck something up or something bad happens, it's just fucking hilarious. But James is just such a shining beacon of like hope and joy and positivity that I don't know. I don't know. It just, it, 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 it hurts me to see something so pure, something bad happen to something. So you should pure. have that attitude to all human beings. No, because like none of prince. us, none of us are anywhere near as pure as James. And you know that. Oh fact. yeah. Well, I agree, go. but well, that's my reason. You should I still think. hurt him. Have you seen <laughs> Aquaman? He's like that. <laughs> yeah. He's like one of the Aquamans. Yeah. The, um, the entourage version. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Well, if you haven't fucking, if you need some cash, bro, we're giving away, by the way, we're just about to do Matt's um, dream diary. Okay. We don't even have a fucking jingle for this thing right now. Okay. That's how special and rare this is. And what else is special and rare? 50 grand in your fucking pocket. Okay? Wow. If you want a chance to win 50 grand, we it's our biggest ever giveaway on the website. All you got to do is sign up. If you sign up as a regular member, you're one entry into winning. If you sign up as a premium member, you get 10 entries 10 10 entries as to, to win the 50k so if you're a premium member right now you've just earned yourself 10 entries if you're a regular member and you haven't like you're listening you're a regular member even if you're on the 21 day free trial you have one entry to win 50 thousand dollars that a, is life change that's a whole new that's a, life. that's like a year's, a whole new year's world. work that's the most money that's ever been given away and ever it's hard for us to like this is risky for us like if if, if this doesn't pay off we're like, fucked. Well, it's going to take like months and months to recoup these losses. Okay, mm-hmm. so we're just we're fucking idiots. We're dumb, fucking stupid pigs. Yeah, but we want to see one of you trouble. guys, one of you guys who pays our way and supports us, get fifty fucking grand. So it's our way of giving back, paying yeah. it forward, if you be. And also, we're going to fly you out here, and you're going to live with Matt for three months. You don't have to do that last bit, but if you want to, you can. Uh, it's probably a lie, guys. I'd watch out for that one. <laughs> but the 50K is not a lie. Do you really, yeah. really want to come and live here with me? Yeah, that's if so she, true. Oh, I guess, yeah, you can't. <clears throat> It'd be you painful. Can't. It'd be higher. Would you have someone live here 
would you have yeah so the winner live here for three months if we paid you two grand yeah <laughs> what dude we could get we should just get to pick the most obnoxious and annoying person we can and i'll find. tell you why i said yes because you've stipulated no rules and i will just go stay at jenna's while uh, they annoy you while you do your work day boom self high five Oh, oh, like but yeah, I pay much. that. It's that was mullet. pretty. That was pretty pretty. All right. Anyway, on to Matt's dream diary. This is where Matt writes down the dreams that he has. They're so confusing and strange. He doesn't get them. He doesn't get it. So he quickly writes them down when he has them, so that someone out there might be able to fucking f- work out what these mean. Because no one knows, and they're weird and scary. And Matt's worried. His girlfriend's crying. He's got a girlfriend now. It's sexy. One it's night in Bangkok time. and the world the your sexy, oyster. sexy dreams. All right. This is Matt's most recent dream. <clears throat> it was time for my weekly appointment with my therapist named Grotch. <laughs> I was keen and anxious to tell her about my latest dreams. Grotch was also always great at analyzing my dreams and relating them to the huge number of mental illnesses and conditions I have. <laughs> I'd known her for years and consider her one of the few people in my life I could actually trust. Grotch saved my life. Dr. Grotch, we'll see you now, Matt, said the receptionist. Thank you. I smiled nervously and went into Grotch's office. Morning, Dr. Grotch. Please, Matt, just call me Grotch. Sorry, Grotch. Dr. Grotch just comes so naturally. Just Grotch for you. Dr. Grotch for other patients, but Grotch just for you. Grotch it is, Grotch. Grotch had a way of making me feel comfortable and at home. (laughs) I felt safe telling Grotch anything. So anyway, Matt... What's been on your mind? (laughs) Yeah, well, as you know, my dreams have been very incredibly vivid and real, but also terrifying and confusing lately. And I've noticed a pattern in the last few. Matt, that's actually good news. If there's a pattern, (laughs) that means it's easier to identify a cause. So what is the trigger in your dreams lately? Well, to be honest, it's kind of strange. Grotch lowers her notepad and pen and leans forward. Matt, it's me, Grotch. You can tell me anything. I felt silly for even hesitating. (laughs) I knew Grotch would understand. (laughs) Okay, well, I've been having these nightmares where it's like a normal dream, but then I end up always having Down syndrome. (laughs) Even if having Down syndrome isn't relevant to the storyline. Like a few weeks ago, I was a cockroach, and for no reason at all at the end of the dream, I find out I have Down syndrome. I glance up and see Grotch. She looks a bit different. She's biting her bottom lip, and she was going red in the face. Grotch? Are you okay? Grotch nods but doesn't speak. <laughs> I give her a second and just decide to continue. And yeah, there was another dream where I <clears throat> where I had Down syndrome as a baby and so my mother rejected me. <clears throat> I look up in shock. Grotch was fighting back laughter? What do you, what? You think this is funny, Grotch? Grotch burst out laughing. She laughed hysterically and was rolling around her chair as she struggled to breathe. I'd never seen anyone laugh so hard. I was heartbroken. How can Grotch of all people be reacting like this? She's openly laughing at me. Grotch, please! Help me understand what this means! Grotch's body still spasmed with laughter, but she managed to point to a table in the corner of the room. I couldn't see anything obvious, so I stand and walk toward what she's pointing at. There's nothing on the table except a small handheld mirror. I pick it up. Surely this can't be what she's pointing at. Is it this Grotch? Grotch still doubled over in laughter and isn't even trying to muffle her laughter. She was laughing loudly and uncontrollably. She's laughing so hard she still can't talk but she nods at my question. I look at her confused and then I turn and look at the handheld mirror. I see my reflection. What the fuck? No, it can't be. I have fucking Down syndrome. I touch it in my face to see if it's real, and it is. Everything on my face has just kind of moved in a bit closer together, and I had a full-blown Down syndrome. I look up at Grotch, and she's laughing even louder now. I look back down at my Down syndrome reflection and feel myself start to shake with panic and despair. Why? Why is this happening to me, Grotch? Action! Click, and then I wake up from my nightmare. What the fuck is happening to me? That was way too real. Why do I keep dreaming about having Down syndrome? And why was it a wet dream? Oh, man. (laughs) I knew where it was going and I got excited. Oh, Grotch. Holy Mm. shit, dude. I don't know what's going on here, Matt, but... Yeah. I think maybe, yeah, talk to someone. It's like... The dream's kind of like your subconscious telling you you need to talk to someone about this. Zoom in on Matt's face right now and see if you can tell what he's thinking. 
because I can. He's nervous. He's thinking about how how others will perceive this. He's scared about his dream out there being out there in the real world, knowing that people will judge him for the thoughts that he's having. And he's scared. He's dead scared. He doesn't even want to make a sound right now. Anyway, let's move on. The great debate debate between between mates. This is the great great debate. That's good. That line is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. As you know, Can we have I a quick bong break before this. I just need a quick. Had to to look at himself in the mirror because he's worried that he's got Down syndrome. <laughs> 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 he has to quickly go and check every fucking hour or so. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, dude. And we're back. And like we played the jingle of the song before, this is the great debate. This is where I give the boys a very controversial topic. And one will argue for that argument and one must argue against that argument. Do we have controversy controversy last time we did this? Yeah, by by the... Yeah, yes. Don't don't measure our views because it's not our views. It's our skills at debating. Because we might get the pro and we're con and we might be at the con and we're actually pro. Yeah, so guys, just important to remember, if you're triggered easily or offended easily, this is not the segment for you. Skip ahead. This isn't the world for you. The boys are trying to win a debate here. These are not their actual opinions on these subjects, okay? Remember that. Do not take this out of context. These boys are just want to win. They don't care about the things that they say. They don't think it, all right? We're very competitive. man. It didn't actually sound anything like like this this song. song. I I hear in my hand I have the argument for and against. Then we'll pick a hand, and then whatever hand they pick is what they will be fucking. Good luck today, mate. Is what they will be fucking arguing for. All right. So paper, scissors, rock to see who gets to pick which hand. Scissors, paper, rock. I pick this hand. I I worked. It was both paper. (laughs) (laughs) It's so stoned. Scissors, paper, rock. Shit! Shit! <laughs> oh, shit. Hurry up. Oh, it doesn't really give me much advantage, does it? No, not really. Which hand do you want uh, this one? Ah, I got what I wanted. All How right, do you know what's in there? So the argument We don't know is, what the argument is. It's yeah, about you don't, exactly. All right, so Michael is against this argument. Oh, I'm for and it. <laughs> is for <laughs> this argument. I, I, already know, I already know it's bad because of Marty's little... <laughs> <laughs> four. <laughs> No, put that fucking One Tree Hills box set away. Today's discussion is women should all do OnlyFans. All women? Yes, all women should do OnlyFans. Oh, sorry. So you're for OnlyFans, Michael's against OnlyFans. Does that make sense, everyone? So all women should do it. Oh, sorry, sorry. You're saying women should you're, you're it's good that women do yeah, OnlyFans. Yeah. So it doesn't not all women have to do yeah, it. Yeah, like sorry, women sorry. Should Let do me it. rephrase. W- women should be they should be completely fine and not taboo for any woman to want to do OnlyFans. Mm-hmm. And Michael's arguing against that. All right, the four gets to go first. So Matt, I'll give you your minute and a half. Starting in three. Oh man, it's two, so hard. One. First. <laughs> oh, you give me like thirty seconds to prepare. Yeah, that's he right, gets baby. Two minutes. That's the aim of the game, baby. All right, come on. You, this this is your bread and butter. You, you No, it's not. Yes, it is. You love OnlyFans. How many no. you subscribe to? 15, 16? Never. <laughs> come on. A 20 seconds gone. No, don't. Start me again. We haven't started yet. Start me again. Oh how my dare God. you? Okay. Are how you ready? Dare you? This is not whoa, how the rules whoa, are meant to be played. Whoa, how dare whoa, you? Whoa. How dare you? Three, two, one, go. Why women should do OnlyFans. Women should do to OnlyFans because they can earn a lot of money doing OnlyFans. Are there any cons to doing it, in your opinion? Now, there may be what some people would call cons, but I don't think so. I think if they have a mature, you know, mindset towards every con that comes at them, I think family. they'll be fine. What about their family? I think their family will be absolutely fine if they sit down and have that discussion beforehand. What if they're not okay with it? What if their father, her father's then not okay Then cut them with loose. It? You are a woman. Your body is your body and you should do it with it whatever you want. And if OnlyFans is the way that you're going to make a living and make a lot of money so you can support yourself and maybe your family as well, I think it is all your choice. 
So you're saying that they should support the family as well if they're... hundred percent. Do you think it affects their family if they don't only fans? No. Why? Because, like I said, if you sit down and have that conversation, explain why you're doing it and, and the, benefit, and the benefits that you get from it, it shouldn't affect them. Financial benefit? Yeah, the financial benefit vastly outweighs the effects that it has. What if they have a son and the son, the friend brings a picture of the son, of the mum naked to school and says, hey, look at this. This is No, his no. She's going to sit him there and go, don't worry, son. Once you're 18, you're going to fuck chicks on OnlyFans. And time. Three, two, uh, one. Begin. Okay. First point. With OnlyFans, I'm pretty sure as a company, they would take, let's say, 20, possibly 30%. If they're a really bad company, like certain companies I know, they might take 50%. Now... <laughs> As a person using that platform, preferably I would say women use it. Now, you could either be smart and make one third to half of your money more and start your own website and do whatever you need be on that website as opposed to using the platform OnlyFans where, look, I think you should maybe try and make more money and post it elsewhere. So you're saying OnlyFans is a bad business decision but there's nothing wrong morally with doing OnlyFans? Look, I'm, I'm saying it. I'm no, I'm not saying I'm for. It. I'm saying don't use it. Was well, the argument was not to use OnlyFans, and I don't think they should be using OnlyFans. Okay, well, what about the good shit? Why? Why do you think ethically it's wrong? Okay, ethically, look, well, look, I'm just gonna say if there were three angels in front of me, I'm not saying you're not an angel if you don't use, <laughs> if you if you are the angel that does uh, OnlyFans, but if there was another angel that was a doctor and oh another God. angel that was a lawyer that did good shit. I definitely hang out and say that those are well. It's more fulfilling. It's more fulfilling with those those sort of angels. Oh, past. So you're saying OnlyFans is not fulfilling. It's definitely not as fulfilling as say saving a life Even if or they do helping get a life. Filled. Like hey, they could physically. It might get create life if you don't time. use protection. Anyway. Yeah, I, was, I, was, I, th I expected better, Michael. I expected better. That was Look, disgusting. I made an argument and I sold it. I said, do not use OnlyFans. And I also said... Hit were, my clock and yeah, shut so, him up. All right, ready? Three, two, one, you got a minute. Well, your first argument of percentages, they actually take 20%. So you maybe should do that. some How fucking you know research. You said 30. I said 20 to 30, so I was right. You said 30. Anyway, we can go okay. back. I was right. Anyway, look it up maybe before you make that argument. I went 20 also, to 30 to possibly half. Uh, uh, hey, talking! Yeah, extra 10 seconds. We'll go. Also, fulfillment. Are you telling me you are not getting fulfilled making that content? Yeah. Fool. You're a fool. Only a fool would think that you are not getting fulfilled. You're talking about getting fulfilled. You're not allowed to talk. Up? Another 10 okay, seconds. Sorry. Take a point. Anyway. So you're saying it is fulfilling? It is fulfilling. It's filling or fulfilling? It's like, both. Okay. So you're saying it's fulfilling? Yes, okay. indeed. All right. Anything else? How there? can you elaborate on that for me? No, sorry. Michael. Oh, sorry. Michael, I will take a point if you speak again. <laughs> How can you not? Three times. He's provoking conversation. He is. Yes, and he's wasting my time. But you could waste your time by signing up to an OnlyFans now. So you're saying it's a waste of time? No. I'm saying you could waste your time. By signing up to OnlyFans? Yeah. <laughs> time. <laughs> Holy shit, I've won. I've won. But what the fuck? You're in such a strong position to your last I felt I, was, I felt I was in such a strong position. I could just go with whatever I want. Just have one stab. I could just have how bad whatever it is. I want. <laughs> it's good to do OnlyFans, but it's a waste of time. <laughs> oh, I will fuck. Okay. All right, last rebuttal. What do you got? Here we go, Michael. Three, two, one, go. All right, going to a person that chose the lawyer path. You just sold your own case out, buddy. Case in point. I'm, I'm well, sorry, I'm, I'm sorry. Kind of confused. <laughs> Can you explain that? Okay, I was trying to say that as a, a woman who's decided to become a lawyer, my lawyer just told me, called me up and said, you just lost that court case, brother. Why? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Wait, so your argument for why women shouldn't do OnlyFans is because your lawyer has called you and said that there's no case. <laughs> That's what I think I was getting at, dude. <laughs> Do you have anything to add? you got 20 seconds. Okay. You you helped me out with your argument and my argument was right. How? Because I the lawyer said, the lawyer called me up. No, yeah, so look, basically. <laughs> no, is that he's done? That's got to be 20 don't seconds. Let, don't make more money. Start wait, your wait, own. Wait, wait, Michael. Time. Start your own. 
Okay, so Michael's <laughs> rebuttal was that his lawyer called in <laughs> and said that the, there's no case or something, and that's why girls shouldn't do OnlyFans. <laughs> Yeah, that okay, doesn't look, really boys, make sense, look, does it? Boys, look, it that is, was a uh, that, no, that, I put it there. That that was um that was fucking shit from both of you. <laughs> okay, that was both very shit. But Michael's was just slightly shitter because his rebuttal had nothing to do with anything. <laughs> Matt gave you a, gave you a chance with the finishing of his rebuttal, but you've you've, you've knocked on. You've you've he's passed you the forty, and you've knocked on. Come. Yeah, holy oh. shit, I fully did. You knocked on. Right? I thought it would be a good like you know when you're trying to explain something by saying another a metaphor. scenario. Yeah, a good metaphor. But yeah, no, nah, that that none of us understood that. No. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go, guys. So um. Oh shit! Let me Sorry. let us know in the comments. Do you think OnlyFans is good or bad, bro? Yeah. Seriously, bro. And why are you there? Sign smash up to smash that subscribe <laughs> button, bro. Fucking smash it. Sign up to our OnlyFans, which is our own website, the University oh, yeah, of well, Michael dot com. Yeah, we've I think we've this... plugged that enough, eh? Sorry, but yeah, go on. <sighs> Next sign up. So. Next clown. All right, guys. We're gonna have an yet another bong break. Sorry about all the bron- bong bong oh, breaks. That's good because we need to oh, get yeah, bamboozled. Yeah. All right, we need James to help set up bamboozled. So we will be right back with bamboozled. Maybe go and check if you've got Down syndrome, Brown. Brown syndrome, Down. Down syndrome, Brown. <laughs> <laughs> oh, maybe that's a good shirt, Brown. Syndrome. <laughs> Brown syndrome. Is that a bad shirt? Brown syndrome. One night in Bangkok, takes a hard man humble. All right, Matt Brown. Hit it. It's bamboozled You've been bamboozled, bitch. Oh, yeah. Um, Where is it? Ready? Three, two, one. No, no, not me. No, not again. Hmm. Please. Yeah. Oh, I'm so confused. Oh. I can't see. You've been bamboozled, bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check it. I say you've been bamboozled, bitch. Not me. Not me. Not me. Oh, still gotta learn it properly. All right, that's so very good. We have James here. Who's hello, James? He's set up bamboozled. Sorry. And um, what do we got? I don't James? even need to introduce it to you because I made like a video. Connor, Hit roll it. that shit. Hit it. I'm gonna inject one of these three lollies with this hot sauce. If you're a website member, you would have seen Michael have a very small amount of this hot sauce the other day and nearly die. <laughs> oh, God, dude. oh fuck! Deal with this, dude. Sorry. I'm literally pushing the middle of this lolly out. I'm gonna fill that with hot sauce and then I'll plug it back up with the same white stuff. So one of these will be a fucked up spicy lolly for the boys to eat. No. Yeah. No. Well, no, not me. Not me. Yeah, it's that it's that de bomb shit, you know. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah. oh, no, I'm sorry, no. but I had to. It has to entertain the rings. Oh. <sighs> okay, there's only thirty three percent chance. Okay, if you're an <laughs> optimistic about this, <laughs> look, I oh, can't no. do this. <laughs> I'm so fucking over chili, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude, chili's so have a bite. shit. Just have a bite of it and then just see what happens. No, okay? no, 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 no. Oh, James is taking Whole over. Thing in the gob and chewing and chewing and swallow. You have to eat it. Man, this is and the hard. best part is I've literally oh sorry I've literally forgotten which one it is I've done that good a job I they have all no look fucking the idea fucking same I've made that I squished the ends on all of them because otherwise I would it would have been too easy to tell mm. which was which I'm very 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 sad <sighs> right, about there's this a 67 percent chance you're not gonna get it that's it's not high to me <laughs> 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 who would like to go first <laughs> I will go first. I will go second. Wait, are you going first? I just want. I am scared. scared. Wait, 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 wait. Should we all just? Oh, hang on. How pick do we do one? this? Same time, you can just yeah. Make, should we all just? No, your, wait. Because we're all gonna go for the same one. We should all pick. You can either put one finger in, two finger in, or three finger. This is one, two, three. Let's see if we all just decide ourselves. Three, three two, two, one. <laughs> three, two, one. 
<laughs> we all chose two. That's so ridiculous. Fuck it. Okay. I'll pick one. I'll pick one. I want two. I don't want three. I have a feeling well, I'll take rock three then. Fuck it. Yeah, let's just get crazy. Wait, we're going one at a time. So one gets to go all first, right. right? All right. No, no, no. no. Do we all eat pop. together? And look at each other. Yeah. That would be the glory. Oh shit, baby! Oh, I should have put chili in all three. Oh, that would have been the oh! prank. <laughs> that would have been scared. great. That would have ended the podcast. Okay, here we go. Ready? On three. Oh. One, two, three. Three. Oh, fuck! Fuck! He's acting, or he's, he's acting, or he's forgotten the game. You gotta eat it. You gotta. What the fuck oh, is this? Oh, you gotta fucking eat it. <laughs> Fuck off! You're just supposed to act. <coughs> oh my god! <laughs> Is it that bad? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I do I have memories. One drop of that shit and fuck my whole meal up. <laughs> Make sure you do it in the mic. People need to hear your pain. <laughs> All right. On Holy th- shit! Did you know what happened there? <sighs> now, wait, mate. Put your phone. Who do you reckon had it? <clears throat> All right. Three, two, one. Point two. You think you had was bamboozle. <laughs> 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 No, no. Fuck. I have a confession. I realized when I grabbed mine that I had it. So then I went to offer mats and I swapped them myself. Bang. You were bamboozled. Not only once, but twice. Wait, so which one was uh, the fucked one in? One. Like, the fucked one was this one. Was, so I would have had that. How would you know? I couldn't tell. No, sorry. Which one did I grab originally? The second one. Yeah. Yep. The second one was uh, fucked. Why did you want the second one then? When we said, we're like, which one do you want? I didn't know. I only knew when I... I, I knew when I... Gra- <laughs> That's in so much fucking pain. <laughs> He's been bad. Booze your bitch. <laughs> yeah. We've been so good if he Not tried me. to hold it together for a while. Oh, my God. Yeah, no. When I went to grab mine when I was getting it, that's when I saw it was oh, fucked. How, so did, well, I, how, how did it look fucked to you? It just looked a bit different and a bit felt moist. Yeah, I I could not tell, eh? <laughs> anyway, so Matt's definitely... We, That's we broke now. him there. Holy <laughs> shit. If that... Oh. <laughs> I can hear it fucking going up. Yeah, that was fucked. <laughs> <laughs> James is going, you've been bamboozled, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, James goes hard on these. Eh? It's fucking good <laughs> shit. Uh, the, if it's one of us, we would have at least tried to hold it together. But it's very that is like insanely hot. That shit. It's it not fucks food. you up. You, ba- it's basically liquid pepper spray for your mouth. Mm. So it's fucked. Matt's gonna be gone for a while. Yeah, like, like he's out. He look, and he had a couple bites of it, <laughs> and then it yeah, would have just, soaked onto he his really tongue. Just had a nibble of it. Man, imagine <laughs> swallowing that. I was considering doing like a tablet and then just, but then I was like, I bet you my insides will burn a hole in them or something. <laughs> yeah, fuck. But anyway, so that is bamboozled, guys. Let us know what you think about it and shit like that. And if you have any suggestions for bamboozled shit, fucking drop that shit in the comments, bro. We love reading that shit. Seriously, please leave lots of comments and lots of likes. All right, please. While Matt's not here, let's agree to this. If this podcast gets 700 likes, we both next week, or the, after this comes out, so in two weeks, we both slap him on the thigh. On the knees. And don't tell him why. No, not because he might yeah. have fuck knees, but yeah, on the so. thigh. On the thigh, each of us, we can't explain why. Yeah. Hey, if this podcast gets 700 likes, just while he's out, he's out, like, out the front with a hose in his mouth, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah, so he's in two weeks like time, for a while. So you hear this, right? And if this gets 700 in two weeks' time, then slappity slap. Make me that. So yeah, during the podcast, you'll do one and then I'll do one. And we can't explain it. But he's just there. Okay. <clears throat> Are you okay? Are you all right? He's got a sp- spit towel. <laughs> he's got a spit towel now. <laughs> Who, so you reckon, would you say you're 90% sure that you got it? <laughs> oh, I'm going to pick you. What, 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 what did you feel immediately? What did you feel? It was like... um. You know when you bite into apples? No, nah, like <laughs> fire. Something's got like a liquid explosion into your mouth. Oh, you know, really? What food has How that? How did he put that in there like that? I don't know. Maybe in. Oh, I don't know. Wow, <laughs> I'm fucking good at shit like my, that. All yeah. my lips are are fucked. Like, how did he do that? 
I realized what I could I'd... not tell the difference. <laughs> yeah. No, I could. I saw something was up with that one, so I quickly grabbed his one. Off, it didn't look, it look yours like looked worse. <laughs> Anyway, let's move on, right? Let's let's move on to uh, a segment that we are doing fortnightly moving forwards, okay? Let's do the voicemail segment, everybody. Hit it, Brown. Hit it, Brown. Come on, Brown. Hit it, Brown. Come on, Brown. Ring in. Oh, shit, the phone. Ring in with your ring. All right, so this is a segment where you guys call 04 666 yeah, that's right. And you guys leave us voicemails, texts, send Matt pictures of yourself, oh. all sorts of shit. Just fucking tell us stories. As long as they're not too long-winded, we can, might be able to play some, okay? So we, thank you for all of the stories we've been getting. Some are like four minutes long, though, so we can't play them. All right, we've noticed the retention drops a bit during this segment, so we've got to try and shorten it up a bit. So please continue to send those through. Know that mm. we will hear them. But uh, they can only make it onto the podcast if they're a little bit shorter. Isn't that right, Flader? Okay. I, do you want me to hook this up to Bluetooth quickly? Oh. Ring in! Are you okay, Matt? It's just my other fucking lips are burning. <laughs> <laughs> His other lips? <laughs> what are you talking okay. You pussy lips. Now, look, oh. this is just someone's theory oh. about what Matt's journal could actually be his dream diary oh this is cool yeah i think i've figured out matt's dream journal i don't think it's a dream journal i think the psychopath has a split personality and at night he turns into his alter ego and that journal is just a diary that his alter ego writes about the things that matt does during the day so i don't think matt even sleeps it's just always awake between him and his alter ego <laughs> I fucking love that. That's just always awake. And his alter ego has Down syndrome. <laughs> well, the boys trip, you didn't sleep. Yeah. So <laughs> there you go. He just sits on a couch like that. No, no TV on, nothing. No lights are on. He just sits exactly like that. Just awake all night. Just, oh. <laughs> So chilly with, with a wig on and shit <laughs> <laughs> and then he just oh. gets up and goes to work anyway now this one is from the archives of fully actual back in the early days oh. you should remember and we all should know this is one of the ogs we all love him but there was a man okay i'm not gonna tell you the name yet there's a man and this is the origin of that man and he has gone missing for a while but he's back and this is his message Hello everyone, this is Donut Films, also known no, as the man who sent my foot skin to your podcast about three years ago. Is your uh, own too. I've sent a lot of other things, but uh, I just wanted to come on here and tell everyone the truth and confirm some things. So three years back, uh, Ma Matthew Brown started a rumor saying that I sent in my semen. Uh, that is completely false. I have never sent in any cum. That was someone else, not me. So fuck you, Matt, and fuck you, Connor. <laughs> Uh, a lot of you were wondering why I stopped watching the uh, podcast for a while. That's because everyone at my school was bullying me. Um, you know, when they first heard about it, they thought, oh, yeah, it's pretty sick. But, you know, as the years go by, they started maturing. They realized, you know, this is a bit of a weird fuck. He's a bit of a freak. So, yeah, it kind of ruined my social life. I just want to say, fuck you, Matt Brown, and fuck you, Connor. But, uh, yeah, I, I didn't. I never sent in that cum. So, fuck you. <laughs> so, you Hang destroyed... On. A boy's hang life. Hang on, hang on, hang on. God. He destroyed Mate, a boy's you life. You need to take accountability and apologize. Hang on. Donut Films. I was wondering. We love, like, me yeah. and Marty have always been fans of you, dude, Donut Films. Dude, I've been fan. I love Donut you Films. You made a lie well, about a boy. boy. You, you, you well, ruined his life. Well, I, School will went you down allow me him? to Sorry. reciprocate? No, let's move on. Prank all time. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> firstly, <laughs> firstly. Donut Phil Donut Films is a uh, is one to do a prank. So I am taking this with a grain of salt. Is that what they say? Mm, yep. Yeah, with a grain of salt. What about Pepper? Oh, so you think he's lying about? I it. think he could be lying. But Donut Films, if that is the truth, you know, and people are bullying you, and I, and it's ruined the last what year, bro. In in my eyes and their eyes, you are a legend. Yeah, that's and so trust true. me. Uh, I will wholeheartedly right now. I don't remember saying that, but he 
he did not send semen in. And the whole podcast community loves yeah. Donut Films. He's a legend around these parts. Donut he's, Films is one unicorn. of the best like fans we've had. Some of the things he's said. He single-handedly kept the P.O. Box section yeah. segment alive for in, in seasons. A fucking yeah. legend. He's so, built, yeah, he's built wells. Yeah. So if that is true, fuck all those people who bullied you. And you should say that to them. Say, fuck you. And if anyone replies, tell punch them, him in the face. Yeah, and tell them Matt's fucking Snapchat and Instagram and tell yeah. them to direct their hate towards yeah, Matt. Yeah, tell them to direct their hate towards me. Matt will fucking sort them out. Okay, Matt will go out and fucking fight all these Every single person who bullies you Donut Films, send them to Matt and say that Matt wants to fight you. He wants to fight you every weekend. And Donut Films, I want an update. What are you fucking doing now? And are you of is he? How old if is he's he over now? eighteen, is would you date 18? him? Yeah. If he's over eighteen, we'll go on a date. There you go. <laughs> well, now look. Moving on. Look, here's a relic. Thank you, Donut Films. But we're going to move on now to something that's been happening the last few weeks that should anger everyone, oh. and mainly a, a guy. And I don't. If you're still with her, Bailey. Surely After not. what she's done, oh, then man. that's your own fault. But I, we have gotten update messages from <coughs> Bailey himself. So we've been trying to call right. Bailey and be in contact with him each week because he's got some Bender stories to tell us. But his girlfriend gets in the way. Yeah, but the only yeah. way we're going to speak to you, Bailey, is through Emily. All right. It yeah. has to be that way. I'm sorry. It's the only way we're going to talk to you. So, like, yeah, Emily's just going to have to suck it up and 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 do and do this for you if, if she loves Emily's you. Emily's a good girlfriend, and if you're just a, a mathematician by now, you know that we d it's been happening on Mondays. You should be with her, or she should be over it. You should have said, Emily, come over to my house right now, and she should be there. You should have or rearranged your Mondays. Have it so that all the calls that go to her phone divert to your phone or something like that. That's more tech. I like yeah. that. That's more mm, reasonable. Yeah, that is helpful. But you messaged us last Monday after what we said <coughs> what Emily did. Saying, fuck you, Marty and Michael. All I want to do is tell my Bender stories. He sent that. And then the next day, okay, he sent, you's a missing out, Martin and Michael. And then this is on Tuesday, last so the day after, he said, you've called Emily and she has let us all down. Call me back on this number. Fuck you as well, Michael. You told her I'm gay and I, <laughs> <laughs> and I don't love her. <laughs> Michael lost control. Okay, he lost control. Of I was angry because I want to. I want to hear your stories, Bailey. Look, Bailey, we want to hear your stories, man. But we can only do it via Emily's phone number. So let's give her a buzz and see what happens. Well, we don't have his number. No, we're calling Emily. We do yeah. have his number right there. He texted us. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> but like, we, we, just we, just we, don't have, we haven't saved it yet, though. Look. Prepare yourself, Emily. All right. Yeah. Look, I've saved Emily's number. Yeah. There, Emily, Bailey's girlfriend. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. It's like the only number we have saved. Oh, it's a long it's unbelievable. She's probably not even going to answer this one. Yeah, she's. This will yeah. be. The person you are calling oh. is not available. Well, let's leave, leave a message. message. Please leave a short message and it will be sent as an audio message. <laughs> Fuck me, Emily. You've gone drop, drop the ball again, bitch. You fucked it up for your fucking boyfriend How once again. How could you do this? We call you again week by week, Emily, and you keep letting us down. You couldn't even answer the phone! Yeah, Emily, you let us down. You should apologize. And we are too. I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm sorry. <laughs> now we call back. Indeed. No, I reckon that's it. She's had her chance, man. Yeah, we 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 give her too much yeah, leeway. Too much. Like like you like, only get one shot with learn. us, bruv. You only get one shot a week with us. Do you know what I mean? Like, I think I just feel like she has to know, dude. The person okay, you are calling sorry. is not available. <sighs> There you go again, guys. Emily still has not answered the phone and she uh, will not meet our demands selfishly. Selfishly, she's... I, um, I just feel for Bailey in, in this so entire right. situation. Imagine That's if, abuse. It's if, sexual abuse. Imagine <laughs> she's sexually abusing her boyfriend by doing this. Imagine if they're still together. Like that. That's madness. Yeah, I know. It can't be. We've just broken up a marriage. No, we've marriage. helped. We've pulled out the, the faults in it and we've saved his life. No, but she hasn't corrected those faults yet, bro. Man, she's still leading a faulty life. Well, if she's, added still new, together, she's added new faults. If bro, they're still together, then she's I'd do She's so worry. fucking faulty, I don't even know how she walks. Yeah. Fuck. Anyway. This, yeah, well, hopefully they have split up. And Bailey, look, just send us a message so we got your number and we'll give you a buzz. <laughs>
we've, we've also got a new WhatsApp number for those oh, people wanting to leave messages internationally. internationally. We've yep. seen your comments, guys. If And if you want to call the number, it's plus six one is the Australian code. But if you just want to send us a WhatsApp message, our WhatsApp number will be in the description. All right, let's move on to our final fucking segment. Are you serious? <laughs> it's prank call time. Yep. It's prank time call. for the prank call, prank call, prank. It's time for the prank call. We don't have a button, Matt. Sing, oh. sing, <laughs> sing. Your time <laughs> is there for us to waste. Pick, Pick up, up your phone with the first mistake. Ha, 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 ha. It's, it's prank, prank call time. time. And this prank call is brought to you by our friends at Joe Fortune, guys. A really cool online, Thanks, Joe. online casino. Go and check his socials. He's doing heaps of giveaways, okay? At Joe Fortune. Go and have a look um, and uh, thank you for sponsoring us. And guys, just remember to please gamble responsibly. If you've got an addictive personality, maybe give this one a miss, okay? Am I right or what? <laughs> thank you, Joe. Welcome to <laughs> in psychology. If this is an emergency, psychology, Georgia. Hey, Georgia. Um, so uh, my name's Margaret. Um, I haven't really ever done any kind of uh, therapy before. So um, mm -hmm. I'm not really sure what the process is, but um, look, I'll, I guess I'll just kind of get into it. Um, so my son, he has um, quite a few learning uh, disabilities. He's, uh, he's, mm -hmm. he's, he's, he's just turned into a teenager, so he's, he's getting quite strong. You know, he's really filled out. Um, and, sure. and I guess, uh, yeah, just he, he's becoming quite hard to handle um, at the moment. And, and mm -hmm. even in public, um, I'm, left, I'm left feeling quite embarrassed and uh, just sort of... Uh, Quite, quite angry at the situations that he kind of puts me in. Um, and, and, and sure. yeah, I, I'm just feeling a little bit of shame around these feelings. I don't know if that makes sense or... Of course it does. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. You are not alone in that yeah, feeling. Yeah, so I'm feeling really shameful. And uh, and then I, I kind of um, feel guilt as well because uh, there, there are occasions when when, when, I, when I just I, I just can't keep it together and, and, and I kind of lash, it, la lash out at him, uh, not not in public, um, but I kind of lash out at him and, and, and it just gets too much. It gets too much sometimes, yeah. and sometimes I just got to, I just clip him, a little clip out of the head, and then and then later on when I've calmed down, I feel myself like I'm I'm literally uh, like shaking, and um I, I'm I'm just I don't really have anyone to talk to out of fear of judgment, uh yeah it's, so it's just becoming um it's just becoming a bit too much, <laughs> if you uh, yeah, can sort of see what like I'm saying. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's a lot so, on your plate. You've yeah, it's quite a bit. Yeah, well, absolutely. It can definitely yeah. help sometimes. Well, thank you. Yeah, he's been doing this thing uh, recently. He, he kind of uh, pr pretends he's a bear. He, he, he comes home from school and pretends he's a bear and he's knocking knocking all the kitchen utensils off the benches and he's pushing all over the furniture and he's he's defecated in the lounge room before. And, and, and it's just my, 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 my husband, he's, he's left years ago, so it's just kind of coming to to be able to deal with that just coming home after a long day's work it's a uh, it's it's just becoming um, a bit too much so i really feel like i need some kind of some kind of way to help me curb my rage when he really gets me to that level yeah sure no i can understand yeah. that for sure <laughs> unfortunately at the moment um margaret i don't have anyone to recommend the books are currently closed with psychologists here I mean, oh, you bring any psychologists oh i'm so georgia i was under the impression that you were actually oh my god i'm so embarrassed right now are you not one of the working uh, psychologists there no, 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 I'm, I'm the reception <laughs> team. Oh, my gosh, I'm so sorry. I've literally never called um, a psychologist before, uh, so I just thought you kind of uh, call and, and start chatting once they answer. Yeah, so I've, I've gone and really embarrassed myself. Yeah, it's not good. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Um, but I can definitely put you on a wait list if you'd like, if we have a psychologist yeah, available yeah, in the next couple of weeks. Okay, yeah, wait list. I've heard that before. Just how long of a wait is this going to be? Am I going to have to wait weeks or is it going to be a month? Uh, I'm not sure at this stage. We're just bringing someone on board now, so it will just depend on their schedule and when they're able to yeah. start with us. But probably within the next four to eight weeks, I would imagine. Okay, great. So um, when when can I sort of get a confirmation of exactly when, what date I can book in to see someone? Um, I, so I can take your details down now and we can definitely give you a call as soon as we get confirmation on when they're yeah. starting with us. Okay, great. Um, yeah. Is this the best number for us to reach you on? Uh, yeah, that'd be perfect, yeah. Can you just read that okay, back to me, that number? Yeah, 0466. Yep. 602. Yeah. 
303. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, that's perfect. Thank you. Um, all right, so uh, I'll, I'll, no so you guys will just give me a buzz when you think you found an available slot with one of your therapists over the coming days or so. Absolutely. Is that correct? Okay, great. That's correct. Yeah, usually within within the next couple of weeks for sure. Okay, great. Well, thank you very much for your help. And again, I'm I'm so sorry for the stupid misunderstanding and me losing my temper at the description of my unbearable son. No problem at all. We'll be in touch soon, Margaret. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Bye. You too. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> that is so rough. Oh. Oh shit! Dude. Oh man, oh, she's gonna tell that therapist. Oh, like she doesn't uh, want. I like fucking a... love. Like she's amazing. Do you reckon she sensed your crazy and just filled up all books straight away? <laughs> all right, so there you go, guys. Um, Margaret might be going to therapy. We should do online therapy, or is that kind of fucked up? Wasting a therapist's time like that. Let us know in the comments if you think <laughs> that we should. Should go ahead and do get some <laughs> online therapy. Of course, they're going to say do it. <laughs> yeah, but but they might be like they're the ones who are going to also be like if if we've crossed that line, we don't know where the line is anymore. <laughs> are we is that is that bad if we like take up take up a th- we pay the therapist obviously what they would usually get paid, but we just make out like Margaret's just fucking insane yeah, and like so her son's just fucked. Y- you're acting like it's an emergency services like triple O. It's not. Yeah. Well, that's look, true. They're getting paid. They're getting and paid. we're yeah. stimulating the economy. Yeah, that's yeah. so true. I didn't think about that. We're yeah. giving away 50 grand on our website. All you got to do is sign up. Platinum members, you have a 10 entries. You get 10 entries for being a Platinum member. Regular members get one, okay? So everyone's in with a fucking shot. Well, Holy you get 10 shit. entries if you're a Platinum member. That's Didn't right. You mentioned that earlier. Yeah, I know. I forgot to. Anyway, guys, please give us a five-star review on um, Spotify, please, because we're still not at 3K. And once we get to 3K, Matt's going to call his mum a dumb bitch on the phone. Like, Wait, I am are not. Are we at 3K? We might be. Should I'm not check? calling her a dumb bitch. Don't ever say that. <laughs> Imagine. No, no. But what I'm you are going to do, you're going to fu- tell her the story. Matt's going to read. I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> okay. It's still a 2.9. We're gone out with 2.9. It's hectic, but it's hectic as shit. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, please. A lot of you aren't subscribed, you listeners. Please just smash that subscribe button, bro. Smash it, bro. Seriously, it helps us, bro, more than you realize, bro. It's hectic as shit. Have the best day in the world because we're the best. And you've been given the best by the best. We're the best. We're the best. We're the best. 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 Self high five. We're the best. We're the best. 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 Best.